Thank you, thank you. Yes. I look cute on TV, I ain't even know. I've been trying to lose weight, man, because I like, I like all type of women, you know what I mean? Like, like, the only type of woman I don't like is an ugly woman. I'm just saying, I can't be fat and you ugly, and we walk around looking like a science project. People trying to catch us like Pokemon, I don't got time. I like all type of women. Like I like, like I, I like big girls. I do, you know. Big, yeah. Big girls always seem like some dessert you ain't had in a long time. You ever hug one of them? You be like, is that red velvet cake? <laughs> Two big people having sex is fun. It just don't make an attractive noise. It sounds like a whole bunch of wet handshakes. Like a locker room full of high fives, like, hey, good game, good game, good game. No, they went undefeated, they went undefeated, that's what they... You gotta think about stuff, man. I was thinking, like, what if, what if I get a big girl pregnant, right? And the baby grow up, start to walk and run, and we can't catch it. We'll literally be unfit parents, you know what I mean? Like, Like, you know how embarrassing that'll be? Like, how I'm gonna fill out a missing person report? Like, sir, when did you realize the baby was missing? I'm like, immediately, I was right there. When he, I was right there when he ran off, I was right there. I, I'm, I'm from Virginia. Uh, yeah, VA, VA. I used to be a server, I used, to, I used to be a server at IHOP. I used to work at IHOP. You know how hard it is to smoke weed, be big, and take orders? <laughs> it felt like me and the customers was always having foreplay. <laughs> They'd be like, yeah, can I get the pancakes? And I'd be like, what kind of pancakes? <laughs> They'd be like, buttermilk. I'd be like, ooh. <laughs> Then they get into it, they're like, yeah, let me get my eggs scrambled with cheese. I'm like, what kind? They're like, provolone. I'm like, provolone? I ain't never did it with the provolone. <laughs> People judgmental. I'm a big dude, I know that. I used to hate having to tell the table we out of what they want to order. <laughs> it's automatically my fault, no matter what it is. I had a lady order turkey bacon one day. I'm like, ma'am, I'm so sorry. We're all out of turkey bacon. She's gonna look me up and down. I bet y'all are out of turkey bacon. I'm like, I like regular bacon. Make your blood pressure go up. You gotta get your foot cut off. That's the bacon that I like. And ju just because something's on the menu don't mean you got to order it. Like, I hop sell T-bones, but if you don't have health insurance, turn the page. <laughs> I had this lady order a T-bone one day. It's how arrogant she acted that made me upset. She was like, um, yes, I would like the T-bone. And... <laughs> Could you tell the chef I like it medium rare? A dude at another table was like, did she say chef? I'm like, yeah, dog, she tripping. Hold on. <laughs> I got this. I got this. I'm like, uh, first off, you want your T-bone from IHA. That's where this joke should end. I'm, I'm talking, I'm like, you want your T-bone from IHA. Anything other than well done. I'm gonna need you to sign this health waiver. Cause we didn't even get this off a truck. We got this out the trunk of a 09 Honda Accord. <laughs> and it ain't never been a chef at I. It's a brother named Breon back there. <laughs> he didn't study abroad? Nah, he killed abroad though. <laughs> y'all been a lot of fun. Thank y'all.